Hello. Yesterday I made a tutorial about making this work, and、uh, that's a very complex progress to make it with、uh, an X power shape, and、uh, we write the J code directly. And today、uh, I show you a very simple way to make it in AdCam. So in AdCam we New model. I make it the size a little smaller as I want. Okay, left corner. Then I draw a rectangle. I give it a size, two hundred and twenty. And、uh, their point, I will make it one hundred and ten. Great. Okay, I got this rectangle. Control C and Control V. So I got a copy. And the transform makes the、uh, coordinates one ninety. Okay, so I got these two rectangle, one on bottom and the other on top. All at the border of this workpiece. I select them all, and I go to path, and、uh, create a V bit coming to path. I choose the two. I like to import my saved one. So it should be here. I choose this one. Ninety degree, thirty-two millimeter. Select, and I do a refresh, and I know the maximum depth is ten millimeter. So here I change the step down to ten, and.、Uh, I think I need to make it eighteen at least, and、uh, others、mm, maybe okay at just now, and、uh, make the two number to two.、Um, okay, the one is okay. So I define the material thickness to twenty. Okay. And calculate now, so we got、uh, two paths down, in one pass. Close this, and then I draw to straight line. It will auto、um, snag to the key point. Click and click. Right click, and make this line. And then I choose it again from here to here. Right click. Okay. So I select this line and hold the Shift key. This one. And then I go to path and the two D profile to path. Profile along the vector, and depth ten. Choose the two as this, and also make the volume down.、Mm, or maybe one way make it. We can do an edit here. We can change the raise to meter per minute. And、uh, step down, we make it turn directly, and here we change the RPM to eighteen thousand, and the feed rate we make it six, and、uh, this we give it zero point five, okay, and、uh, select. We calculate it now.
Okay. So we simulate. You can see here is the first one, and then the second one. Okay, I think it's just uh, simple and it's easy to get this work down. But if you analyze this uh, G-code file, you may find that there are some useless moving in these two paths. But it doesn't matter. Although it is not so high efficient as the one we made yesterday, but the making progress of these two paths is rather simple and easy. So I think um, if you making wood doors and you need this grooving perfect, you can use this method to get your work down and it's rather easy for you. Okay, thank you for watching. If you want to buy laser machine or the same solution machines, please contact me. I sell high quality machines in China. I'm Liu Xing. See you next time. Bye.